Hey guys, welcome back. This is part 44 of Let's Play Paper Mario. And with the Master Magnator. All right, let's go. Let's hit okay, the let's turn switch. off this lava. Beak. Yeah, magical switch of hope and wonder. Yeah, look at those graphics. All righty. Clearly, it is the pinnacle of graphics technology, this Obviously. game. Obviously. <laughs> I mean, come on. This is awesome. Walking yeah. over newly cooled lava. Wait, wait, get out your diamond pickaxe and mine the obsidian. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> we need to make a portal to the nether, come on. <laughs> and now, you can walk, just walk along. Woohoo! Yay! Alright. And now that we can do that, we can go anywhere! How beautiful. We can grab this. Uh, Is there anything? No. Oh, that's all great stuff, so <laughs> F you. I did that too. I went and stocked us up. Because yep. items are important. Indeed. Yeah. Yeah. There's some and of course, you're always over prepared for Bowser's Castle because oh, yeah. you expect it to be this big half. epic thing. I and use then like half yeah. the items I get. <laughs> so. Because you have this conservative thinking of, no, I need to save that for ba Bowser. And of course you use, what, half of your items on yeah, Bowser, maybe. maybe. I use like three usually. Yeah. Because really, this is an easy game. Like, uh -huh. this is an easy RPG. You, healing items are much more important in Earthbound, you know? So you're, it's much easier to die. <sighs> Alright, but now we have a key. So we may continue. The key. I am the key bearer. I'm just gonna leave that mystery there for future adventurers. <laughs> for future You know, Brian, I used to be an adventurer <laughs> like you, but then I found a mystery. <laughs> and when you used it, a, a pebble <laughs> fell on oh, your head oh, and hurt you. And I died. I, had, I was in peril. It was the only item I had. It was gonna save my life. But now. <laughs> And welcome to the caverns below the castle. Oh, creepy. We must traverse these in it? order to get There's back. There's something this reminds me of, and I don't know what. Uh, the Aladdin game? A little bit. Yeah. A little bit. That one level in the caverns? And Peter Brittle. I hate that level so much. Why is that Peter Brittle? Peter Brittle, yeah. No, seriously. No, yeah, I, I see like it. That looks like Peter Brittle. <laughs> the Peter Brittle Rouge. We must embark. For us, we shall embark on the road made of the brittle peanuts. Quite so. <laughs> quite so. Mm, quite. Name of the part? I think so. <laughs> okay. Uh, now you die. Defense. Best part about what? Yeah. Defense? What is defense? Defense. <laughs> She's I like, what's up? She's like, I'm electricity that's alive. What is defense? <laughs> See, it's like that son from Doctor Who that was alive and was eating the- never mind. <laughs> if you guys didn't notice, I'm really into Doctor Who. Just saying. You didn't notice. I'm sure you did. It's like, you don't care. I hate having to do things in the dark in this game. It's scary. Yes, you that's why know, you have watched. Fall and die. Okay, <laughs> Three ways see. to go, yeah. Oh, it's oh there's an item Maybe up there. See that. Must get it. Have to get it. I'm required by law. You can't even use it. Like, it's probably useless. Yeah. Yep, useless. Yeah, awesome. It would be useful if I wasn't full on items already. True. They're good at getting, getting shell animals. Animals. Shell enemies to fall. Which there are plenty of in Bowser's Castle. So, wait, Brian, what's your favorite party member? What? Absolutely. See, mine's Bow. Bow. I just yeah. said Bow. Wow. Okay. You yeah. suck. It's Bow. She's my favorite. You must now commit seppuku. Ah, oh, dang it. I hate committing seppuku. I hate seppuku. Or as some weird Americans will pronounce it, Harry Carry. Uh, <laughs> Harakiri. Oh my gosh. Harry Carry. Harry Carry. <laughs> Harry Carry. <laughs> How dare you commit Harry Carry? Harry K. Ew. Carrie's Harry? That's <laughs> Jeez, yeah. Razor. <laughs> this just got really weird, you guys. I'm sorry that you have to sit through this. <laughs> this is what happens when, no. I'm, when I'm coming to Yes, I else. live. If you guys didn't know, the, the last part of Earthbound I just put up, um, I w it was supposed to be, well, we, I recorded it with Smash King, uh, Kyle, my friend Kyle. 
but it was terrible. It was the worst part I've ever recorded. Not because of him, but because I didn't do like anything. It was almost a half hour long, and we did almost nothing. <laughs> we got about to Grapefruit Falls, is as far as we got, you guys. If you watched the last part of Earthbound, you know how sad that is. So, yeah, I just scrapped it and re-recorded it by myself. Because he happened to come over, and we've always wanted to, uh, you know, Yay, record quick it. change. And I'm sure he's watching this, and I'm sorry, Carl. But we'll record it. What? Someday. someday he'll be oh, back. it's dark. So? So, only walk can do anything. Oh, that's weird. I didn't know that. Yeah. I didn't know that whatsoever. Wow. Yeah. Oh, interesting. I forgot that. I knew at one point. I guess I've never tried switching out of what? As many times as I've played this game. Yeah. I guess I've Well, really, how many times do you actually go through Bowser's Castle when you play this game? True. Oh, uh, yes. I've started this game mm -hmm. way more than I finished it. Yeah, absolutely. Though I guess that's true of a lot of games. I've started FF7 like seven times, and I've beaten it once, you know? <laughs> oh, are you kidding me? Oh, okay. you went the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but you got some star points. Okay. Don't drop. Yes. Drop. Oh, yes, drop. Ooh, fancy. Now, you can't fall into oblivion in this game. It just. That's true. You know that always bounce back up. Yep. That's funny. It's weird when there are games like that. Like, yep. funny. And like, what's funny is this is a Mario game, which that's yeah, like that's a staple point. of Mario is being able to fall off into forever. But yeah, it's funny in Zelda games too. Like if you fall into lava or whatever, you just like there's like a cutscene of him in pain, and then you're just back there. Like really, dying's not a big deal in Zelda games. Yeah. That was yeah, that was great. I didn't do it right. I've never used that before. Oh. I think it's alternating. Yeah. No, you just... I just have to use the two fingers that would do that best. Dude, my index finger, I can, like, spaz it and make it hit the button super fast. Like, yeah. over and over. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I guess that's what video games do to you. It makes your fingers that spaz. That invisible one, I can't do anything. Yeah, absolutely nothing. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> you should have just appeal to the crowd, but that this isn't that was in your door. Which I, I'm screwed. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you're screwed. Nothing, you got nothing. It's okay, you have full health. You've lost like no health, it's not a big deal. Yeah. It's funny, I used to I used to think I hated um, I'm just gonna do turbo charge. I used to think I hated that was in your door, but I never really played it. So <laughs> like I only I didn't even beat the first boss when I played it. I just decided that I didn't like it. But I played it again and I love it. Oh gee. It's great. I might I'll probably LP it someday. You know, it's kinda like a sequel to this. But that will be for all. I don't really care for it. You've never really Thousand Year Door. I know, but I, I, I just didn't want, like I just it. didn't like that they made a sequel of this game anyway. Uh, you should play it. I'm just a bit. I'm and, a bit of a snob like and that. Don't think of it as a as a sequel to this game. Yeah, I know. I think that'd be better. Because as just a game, it's good. It's fun. Of course, it's so different. For the longest time, I had no idea this was a sequel to Super Mario RPG. True. Well, it's not really a sequel. Right. It's just. But it's like the same story. Yeah. It's like the exact same story. And the, the playing style and items okay. especially. Now we can finally go through that first door. That was the first yeah. door. <laughs> the first one. Okay. This is a nice area. This the middle cool. area. This is a cool so little area. let's see. Down here I believe is a makeshift toad house. Way down here? Yeah. Down in the dipsh. Yep, okay. Yep. But there's nothing. <laughs> That's okay, okay, that's what Cooper's for. It's only, there's only one thing. Yeah. Uh, eh, get back here, you! That's better. Won't do any damage, I just like to initiate battle. <laughs> oh my gosh. Don't waste a quake hammer on him. Yeah. Oh, but a hammer won't do anything. Oh, power smash. Yeah. See? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, so close. Sad. Oh, and he's calling reinforcements. I should have just wasted the FP. Yeah. Oh, this is a toad house. Yeah. You can just wa okay waste it now. Yeah. Well, now I'm gonna do this. Yeah, you know, this just means free XP. Yep. Okay, he's 
he's dead now. <gasps> you have 37 star points! Yay! One of my favorite numbers. All because of my Donya 37. <laughs> It's made me look for 37 in things all the time. Just because. Sonic's 7. And 3 is. Okay. I'm weird. Alright. So now I can come back here whenever I need to and use this Toad House. And so. Sleep on a slab I, of So I can coffee. continue to avoid using all those items that I'll never, <laughs> never completely use up. You get to have a nice rest on a slab of concrete. How lovely. Yes. And it'll be the best sleep he's had in the past few days. <laughs> in the past five months, it was yeah. not recording. Poor guy. He's been sitting in oblivion for five months. Doing <laughs> nothing. He's like, please play. So I get another universe. There's a universe where, you know. That would just be disturbing to think about, that game characters are all just sitting there, sitting waiting. in oblivion, waiting to be played. That's really depressing. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Isn't that lovely? Oh, sweet. It's kind of like that. When I was a kid, I thought when you played a DVD or a tape, that the actors had to redo it for you. Uh huh. Yeah, so that's what I thought too. So I used to think that, um, uh, um, what's it, Steve Burns? Steve from Blue's Clues? I thought he hated me because I made him act so much. Because I watched that all the time when I was yeah. a kid. So here's a little shop where you can buy from this spiked Goomba. But the prices right. are ridiculous and it's pointless. Well, yeah, since I have full items, full there's no reason. <laughs> the best thing they have there is the Super Shroom. But we have Ultra Shrooms. Because we're ultra awesome. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Blah, blah. <laughs> and kill him. Kill the Lord. Are we on time? We're doing great on time, Ryan. <laughs> See, back in the old days, I used to suck at keeping time in LP, but now I'm good at it, so we're good. And there's no time limit anyway. So, we're good. Still nice for people if we... I know, I keep it, I keep it around 15 minutes. <coughs> Except for Earthbound. Those are long. But they seem to like it, so... I ask, and they're like, Oh no, I'm making 40 minutes! That's awesome! <laughs> They talk, I am they so talk like that, you know. Now. All that, the whole audience talks like that. Never do, bro. Oh. I'm kidding. Audience. Audience. What are you doing, audience? Speaking of audience, I'm gonna vlog. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get when I soon when mom gets her tax return. <laughs> we are, we are me and her are getting iPhone four S's with theory, so. I'm gonna make her call me master, cause I'm a psycho. Anyway, no about that. It'll make it'll make it so I have an awesome camera. So I'm gonna record vlog. Yay! Actually, I already made the channel and everything. So yeah, that's awesome. Oh yes. And he just owned those guys. I love Air Raid. That's a good attack. This doesn't take very much FP. It takes like five, right? Yeah, for hitting all enemies, it's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, he finally it's hit one of the me. Best I was avoiding him. It's one of the well best before. hit all enemies one time. Yeah. Remember, there's a toad house back there. Yeah, but I don't want to come back here. You just want to go all the way back. Uh, yeah. F that. F that. That's almost cheating anyway. Feels like cheating. <laughs> Even though it's technically not really cheating. Oh. Duplicate. Oh, I'm gonna heal them. Wow. I hate these guys. I hate them with a bloody passion. All right, here we go again. <laughs> yeah. yeah! I see your duplication and raise you an air raid. <laughs> raise you an air raid of doom. Yeah. And that's how you play <laughs> Mario Poker. <laughs> Mario Poker. That'd be an awesome game. Yes. Oh my gosh, they should make that. What have you got? Two mushrooms. Two mushrooms, baby. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Well, I've got three stars. Oh. You, you know why that's funny? Uh, back Nintendo in the 1800s. Yeah. Yeah. Nintendo. Yeah, in the late 1800s. Late 1800s, way before video games, the Nintendo company made playing cards for for the for kids, and soldiers, and stuff. Yeah. So that's pretty awesome. The playing cards were for kids. The games were for soldiers. <laughs> True. For 
uh, when Sega was founded way back Sega. in like 19... Sega was the first company, you know. Yeah, they were the first, first game company. company. Very interesting. The whole history of games is really interesting. Okay, ah, that's right, this whole water... And how it's come thing. down to, some of it's, come, half of it, really, has come down to, to douchebags playing Call of Duty. I mean, really, that's what it is. <laughs> Sorry if you're one of those. <laughs> I'm not a... Well, we're not sorry if you're a douchebag playing Call of Duty, but if you're if someone who plays Call of Duty and you're not a douchebag, we're sorry. We're sorry. We don't want to be mean. But, you know, if you drink Mountain Dew and play Call of Duty and you don't think you are, you might be. <clears throat> what? No, I love you guys. Don't be mad. Don't hit that unsubscribe button. Come on. <laughs> Let's talk. We can talk about this, please. Anyway. <clears throat> Better not mention the Facebook gamers. Oh. Facebook. Farmville! Oh my gosh. Epic Farmville. Farmville. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are Tobuscus fans, go check out his Farmville commercial. It's one of his older videos, but it's like his funniest one. Uh, good times. Boy, oh, yeah, Looks oh, like oh, somebody woke up, woke up on the wrong side of the Farmville. <laughs> Boom! Boom shakalaka! Now, did you know that now I can use that to sync the audio? <laughs> Me screaming boom right on the bit. <laughs> hey, look. Yeah. It was paper the whole time. No. The whole time? The whole time. Oh my god. Who knew? All he needed is a pair of scissors and he could beat the whole. <laughs> Kill Bowser. Just with a pair of scissors. Snip. It's awesome. That'd be awesome. Off with his head. Chink. It reminds me of that uh, comic called Control of the Leap, and yeah. it, uh, and there was one where he had a where he had a cutout of Paper Mario. Uh, he, he likes to watch fire. fire. <laughs> He's like, oh no! Uh, good times. All right, wait. Part ending time. <laughs> All right, so this is the end of the part while he jumps around like a fool. <laughs> So, we'll see you guys next time in part 45, when we continue on in Bowser Castle. Thank you guys for watching. See you, see next, you next time. Bye-bye.